What's up, folks? Welcome to Arena Open Day 2 Draft 1 here for Murders at Karlov Manor. Back-to-back -back weekends of uh, high-stakes draft. Let's see what we can't make work here in the open. Well, terrible rare, but great uncommon. Perimeter Enforcer is the pick here. It's like Perimeter Enforcer and then Escape Tunnel and then nothing. Um, so if you don't know the format of these, uh, the f basically the first draft is you'll play four matches. Um, three and one or better gets you to the second draft. And if you make it to the second draft at four and oh, then you have a loss to give. Um, and then there's, there's some gems and cash prizes in the second draft. So that's the goal here. I'm pretty happy to start off with Perimeter Enforcer. I don't think Illicit Masquerade, even though I did kind of get got by it yesterday, I don't think this card is, is quite worth it. Um, but I was impressed by it in a red-black shell. Um, all right, Perimeter Enforcer, that is. Still waking up here a little bit. Mm-hmm. And... While I think Torch the Witness is better than Makeshift Binding in a vacuum, I think the white card that we have is going to bump up Makeshift Binding to be the pick here. Um, this pack's a little stronger, not by much. I mean, there's an Extract, there's Gravestone Strider, which is a good tool for um, the Leave the Graveyard decks. But... Uh, but I just don't think it's in, really in the conversation beyond just the two removal spells here, Binding or uh, or Torch. And yeah, love Binding. If I can start Mono White, I'll be pretty happy. So we'll see. We'll see if we can make that work. A Jace, you say? I don't think this is the pick, but it is sweet. Um, there's an Exit Specialist and a Killer Among Us. Really close between the two. I think I'm going to take Specialist. I think my ideal for starting white and certainly starting Perimeter Enforcer would be to be blue-white. Um, I guess or red-white, but one of those two. And so then just giving the nod to blue card or giving the nod to two drop here plus detective over the five drop. This might be more powerful. Um, but I think we take specialists. I really don't like that on my watch. I also think the gap is, is too big here to take Granite Witness over Specialist. It's an interesting pick, though. Uh, and now we just pivot away from white slightly and take Evidence Examiner. We could also take Analyst. Um, but I think Examiner, like, we already have a blue card. There's not really a world where I'm going to play Analyst with these white cards. And again, I think Technician is too, one, too narrow because it doesn't go with our first two picks. Um, and two, just not as powerful. So we can take Examiner, and, and this might be signal adjacent for us. We'll see. Um, okay, swing back a little bit towards blue white if we can. Take the Granite Witness. Um, over what agency outfitter and Hazda vigilante? I don't think. I don't think there's much to discuss there. Pretty clear witness in my book. Um, okay, projector inspector sixth. Again, signal adjacent, um, and we are a little flexible here in terms of. Would like to be blue white if at all possible. Can be blue green splash binding if something else happens. But those are really our two paths at the moment. Yep, Inspector that is. And another one. Wow, this card's wildly underrated. You love to see it. Um, at least I do. I love to see it being underrated because I get to take it. And I could take Fae Flight over what? Fanatical Strength and Sanguine Savior. Um and branch of Vitugazi. I think it would just take Fae Flight. Maybe we end up having something to protect. I really don't like this card very much, but... Um, we might end up playing it. I don't know. All right. Fae Flight out for now. Take Thinking Cap. 
Um, you know, if we don't end up with uh, the go wide payoffs, um, and what is everything in our deck a detective right now? So yeah, thinking cap is a nice wheel. There might be another one too. Cease and desist. I'll take it's a good sideboard tech at the very least against like blue red to have just like a destroy all your stuff card um, and certainly if you're green if you're base green playing cease is okay too uh, make your move and not on my watch nice wheels take a make your move certainly main deckable um, may not end up wanting to do so um, but we'll take it there and uh, nothing here felonious rage Red really wasn't open. There's a world where we end up black-white. Probably not, but shall see. Uh, I can probably move Examiner to the side at this point. And Defenestrated Phantom. Okay. Um, I was expecting an Ezrum. I've grown accustomed to receiving Ezrams in Pack 2 in competitive events. Uh, I'll take a makeshift or a Marker Watch Phantom. Um, I also think Call a Surprise Witness with Double Projector Inspector is something worth thinking about, but I think just a Market Watch Phantom is is going to be good here. Could wheel an on-the-job, unauthorized exit. I don't like Case of the Filched Falcon outside of Blue Red. Yeah, I would, I would hope maybe we wheel one of these three. I mean, I assume we will exit. I'd rather have one of these two, but I'm going to take Phantom here. It is possible that on the job is the right pick, but I think I think the two drop is what I must take. And this is actually pretty interesting. I well, there's a I mean, reckless detective is the best card. I don't think there's a world where we can end up being red. Seasoned consultant is the next one. Like if we were still kind of waffling about our second color, I think we could take dog walker, but we're not, and we have what three detectives matters four with cap like i think taking two drop detective is is the move here um and just try and tempo people out might wheel granite witness yeah, i think consultant is uh is better for us uh yeah how uh, another print run of granite witness dog walker i think i want out cold i think that's a better bang for the buck here over witness i really want to make sure i have at least one of these in my deck so um analyst that's what's up analyst great with double projector inspector another good two drop detective I'd play Auspicious Arrival too, but yeah, there we go. Another Consultant and another Out Cold, but yeah, ha happy with the Consultant here. Yeah, we're bringing the beats for sure. Oh. I got excited that this was the, I mean, obviously it's not. I was like, is that Thopter Fiction? No. Um... Is there ever a world where we end up going green? Maybe. Probably not. Um, in that case... Yeah, there's, it's, it's always possible. I'll take a bite down, I guess. Oh, all right. I think Watchdog isn't bad. And I don't think I need to take another Analyst, given how good my curve is right now. I think Watchdog fills a nice spot for us i mean if we get more out colds or more um uh on the jobs then it'll be different but like we might not care about this but for now i think we'll do that take the crocodile oh we got call a surprise witness back okay nice i think i want that over exit and another fey flight sure unclear to me if those are good. I think they are not. So removal is really the thing I need going into pack three. That's about it. Like, 
and and an on the job maybe some like some some pump arrivals are on the job but yeah All right i'll take a etb tapped surveil land surveil island scoundrel all right, now we get an Ezrum. Well, we, ooh, I was gonna take no witnesses, but there's a neighborhood guardian. That's that's about the best. I mean, is this the best non-rare? Probably. And is it the best non-rare for our deck? Obviously. What might we wheel? We're not gonna wheel on the job. We might wheel Inspector. Might wheel another Call of Surprise Witness. Not really what I'm interested in. Um, but yeah, Guardian's awesome. Take that. In another life, Doppelgang, we might have been able to do it. Privatized slaps. Is everything a detective in our deck? I think almost. That Guardian is now not. But I think every other... And, and Watchdog. Every other creature is a detective. So, currently at 10. Um, might wheel Consultant. Probably won't wheel Witness. But yeah. Private Eye, let's go. Novice Inspector over Push Pull, I think. Push Pull's value goes uh, quite a bit down, I think. Uh, like, obviously, if this were pack one, pick one, I would take Push, I think, over Fugitive Codebreaker, but it's because of the flexibility of where it can end up, the possibility of being able to cast both sides. We know we can't cast both sides. We also know our tempo aggro deck is less interested in um, destroy a tapped creature. So, Novice Inspector, let's go. Oh, Fuss Bother. Excellent. I mean, yeah, Inspector and Nightwatch also would be good, but this is the go-wide payoff that we really, really want. Um, Fuss is great for us here. And kind of nothing. I don't think... I really don't think I'm playing any of these. I'll take the two-drop. I'm, I'm never going to put Fairy Snoop in this deck, so that's that. Reasonable Doubt versus Thinking Cap number two. Hmm. Think I'm in for Reasonable Doubt over the cap. It's not quite like... It's pretty good tempo. And now Candlestick versus Haunch. Oh, Haunch with... Uh, I mean, also just... Haunch with our Flyers is good, but also Haunch with... Neighborhood Guardian is great, and not taking the second Thinking Cap does open up space for us to take that. Uh, criminologists to the board, and we got an on-the-job. Let's go. Okay. It's pretty pretty gassy. 14 creatures. I would like more. I might end up playing that Bubble Smuggler. We'll see. But yeah, on-the-job is awesome. Witness is awesome. Let's go. Uh, I already have a phantom. We can take an inquiry. Conundrum. All right, so this is 23. Do I want 22? I don't think so. I do have double projector inspector, though. Is there anything better? Like Crocodelf versus Bubble Smuggler? I kind of think I want Bubble Smuggler. Oh, wait, hold on. Where? What just got cut? It's 15 creature. Oh, I cut a land, right? Because there was a forest in here. So this is 8 8. Do 9 8. Cards that I could cut. I could cut think like thinking cap is probably the one I would cut for uh, an eighteenth land. I don't think that's what I want to do. I think I'm gonna run it like this. I think our curve is low enough that I can get away with. Like that's one of the reasons that like I 
ran 18 lands of the PT was Ezrum, like needing white, white, blue, blue for it, wanting to get to six lands for it. Don't quite have that here. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's going to be the deck. We'll go record the podcast, see what Ben thinks, and then be back for the matches. All right, here we are for match one. Um, I You may notice that there's a make your move in my deck. The last uh, change that I made was, I was just looking at the deck and thinking about it and I have tons of creature augmentation and not a ton of interaction, so I decided to cut Thinking Cap and main deck make your move. So that's where we're at. We'll keep this. actually thrilled about that swap immediately here. On the draw, getting an additional uh, piece of interaction um, feels good. So that's where we're going to start things. Opponent mulligans and leads on planes. A little bit of no-rush magic here. Projector Inspector will save us, though. See what they do. They have a Tristani, so we'll just probably just kill that immediately with a make your move over a binding. <clears throat> yeah, I think I think we do that. Sorry for the noise. I'll just do that now. Museum Night Watch, great. Um, I think I just want to lead on Inspector. Because what I can do is Inspector, then I can Witness, Flip Up, Tap, get a loot, then I can Private Eye Binding. So I think I like leading on Inspector here. Uh, yes, I'll take action. So Specialist. Another nice card to see. I think we can afford to ship a land here. Call that good. I am shuffling some cards. I hope the thwacking is not too bad. We'll do that instead of uh, clicking incessantly. No blocks. Unclear if we'll go for bounce or tap here with specialist or witness. Crovod haunch. Yeah, okay. Well, I think that means we're going to um, go for the flip. So we'll do face down. And I could attack. I actually think that's okay. I think attacking is okay. Like, do I care if they trade? Probably not. And I'm not blocking the Night Watch. I think we'll attack. Okay. Because what I get to do is... I assume they put Haunch on uh, the face down. They're not going to put Haunch on anything. Okay. And they're just attacking there. Do I... Probably just bounce now, yeah? Yeah, I think we just bounce now. Get my loot. Yeah, I think it can be a land here. Gives me the opportunity to private eye phantom next turn. Gives me the opportunity to witness. I can phantom binding. I think we just ship the land. Perimeter Enforcer, and an Equip, and a Consultant, okay. Uh, jobby, on the jobby. Um, uh, 
I can private eye. I think we'll, we'll private eye here. We're probably going to ship. We'll take action. Oh my, yeah. I think we're shipping. Uh, what are we shipping? On the job? Yeah. You can't be blocked. Attack both. Am I okay to trade specialist for enforcer or a morph? Yes. So attack both. And they'll play phantom. Shipping on the job might be wrong. Maybe I should have shipped binding. I, I've been thinking that I want to play binding on the enforcer because what they're likely to do is equip next turn. So I'll just play phantom. Take action. Ship a land. Okay. Land number five. Not equipping haunch. Hmm. Wonder if they feel like ah toll smear. Okay. That is fine by me. So. I think we're just on witness flip up this turn. Uh, sure, attack. This is, I have feelings that this game is one I like could have one and may not be able to, but we'll see. This feels like the, the, the crux of the turn slash me binning so many lands has also made it so I can't quite double spell as effectively, so we'll see. We shall see. So we'll flip up, tap the 5-5. Five five. What is this? Yeah, okay. Tap you. Take action. We will draw. I want to I want to have out cold. I want to have binding. I think I want to ship inspector. As perhaps weird as that is. Really? Uh, definitely this. Is that definitely true? I might, I might trade trade here. They're going up to 17. Yeah, I think I trade here. But not with Enforcer. Okay. Face down Nightwatch. I don't love that they think they have other options. Okay. Yeah, analyst is awkward. 
Um, so we're going to play analyst and then out cold the flyer on the 5-5. Five five. Attack. And then we get to crack the clue, attack for eight unblockable, or flying and then unblockable. Oh. Well now. It might just be better to cast Bother here. Get in for seven in the air. Yeah, I'm into that. In the two lands. Make your move, sure. A fellow make your move gamer. That is just fine. Flip up the night watch. Remember that haunch can always be um, three life for them. So next turn, we're going to binding the, the five, five, crack a clue, attack with analyst and two flyers, leave one back for enforcer, there's a face down. They'll always have a pause because of haunch. Land number three, okay. Or three untapped, number six. All right. So start with a clue. Wow. For the amount, right, so you will be the one. Four, five, six. Though, I'll have this back. The awkward thing is if they have a detective to flip up, then this will be a 4-2. And so it's like, do I want to attack? So many lands in the bin, too. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... The nice thing about going for seven is that they have to attack with Enforcer. I think we go for it here. Because if they do end up attacking with Enforcer, then I'm going to feel dumb when I chump with a Thopter, you know? Play Binding, Exile the 5-5. Five five. Put analyst on the consultant, I think. No, they're only attacking with enforcer, yeah. I don't know, maybe I should have left a Thopter back. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, four lands left. Three lands left. That is tilting. All right, I think now we can only attack. Gosh, maybe attack with none. Attack with two. 
Yeah, I guess attack with two. Fizzling. Bloomkin, sure. Tense first game, huh? Mm-hmm. Please know on the job. Got the Enforcer off the board. The game is very close right now. That was a terrible draw. Just abysmal. Yeah, I'm just attacking with one. Where's my haunch? Okay. They're doing this on their turn. Why? I think I must. Right, there's mine. There's my haunch. Uh, equip. Zoop. Attack for three. Attacking for four doesn't matter. Play a land, move the haunch to you. I can trade with consultant if they want. Oh, they're they're flooded too. Okay. Oh. Okay. Block, block. Ouch. My turn. Deck, please. Equip. I'm like wondering if I want to cast Reasonable Doubt just to suspect my Thopter here. But I think I don't. I think I'll let this resolve. Oh, I should have cast this pre. Oh, I'm going to get so punished. Yep, what is this? A 4-3 flyer. Yep. <laughs> okay. Play Watchdog. Land Equip. Tapping so purposefully for your morph. Arch Druid's Charm. Okay. 
please be a seven drop. Another Tulsimir. Ay, yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Really need a way to draw a card here, deck. Novice Inspector, please. I think we crack this. Jeez. All right, so I blew it. I blew it. Yeah. I could have won this game. And now I think I cannot. Yep. You, you, you. Not bad. That Karlov Watchdog turn is really going to haunt me. Okay. A block. It's a 6 5, so. Not even sure what's left for me in my deck. B2 Gazi Inspector. One witness and a bunch of twos and lands. Okay. We'll call a surprise witness could be good. That could do a thing. Granite witness can do a thing. left vengeful creeper just big bada boom okay yeah all right you got it oof oh i'm so tilted right now wow okay Focus up. Double Tulsimir. Does that make me want to... That does make me want to play a 5-5, five five, I think. Over... I like Reasonable Doubt still, too. Over what? Yeah, maybe over call a surprise witness. Okay. <sighs> Double Tulsimir.
play a little slower. Play first. That is a keep. Inspector into analyst into crack a clue attack. The dream here. Mm hmm. I feel like I just want to play witness, loot, and attack all. So that's what I'm going to do. Yep. Okay. Much less exciting. Let's just do one of those again. Let's keep haunch on one. All right. Seasoned consultant. Yeah. Big bada boom energy coming. Stuck on white. Yes, they are. No blocks. Let's capitalize, baby. Inspector. Trigger, trigger. Get these lands out of here. Attack. Your own enforcer, sure. No blocks. All right, let's hedge maze. Uh, I have the opportunity to double spell. So I'm going to loot first, actually. Yeah, OK. Pitch planes, attack both, play hedge maze. OK. Land number three. Play a disguise. No. Whoa. Huh. Oh, is this, I have no idea what this is. Um, I'm gonna play this face down. I'm gonna just attack with Enforcer. Okay. What is this? No disguise creature? No nothing? 
Land four. All green cards in your hand. Um, I mean, I can flip up and double block, like untap and double block. Kind of interested in that. Um, I would like to untap you. Looting four lands away, or surveilling one and looting four away. I'm gonna double block. Like you have auspicious arrival, you have on the job. Like oh, this is just no witnesses, and I'm gonna cry. This might just be crack, haunch. But uh, we're going to do this loot first and then play watchdog and attack all. And hopefully this is just the hammer. Okay. Wait, why are... You should have let damage happen. This is very confusing. Okay. No sweeper, please. This card is the bane of my existence. I'm so tilted. I can't be chatty. I'm too tilted. I'm just like seeing red right now. I mean, I guess how how tilted are they that they're stuck on white? But like, okay, there's a face down. We pass. Attack. Flip up. Oh, don't block. Okay. Bub smug. A consultant. There it is. Here's Tulsimir. Oh, it's just Creeper, and we win. <sighs> Holy cow! <laughs> Why is that the match? I, I feel like I have had no witnesses cast against me so much in these scary spots. All right, 1-0. Oh, also, shout out to Make Your Move.
I'd like to see Thinking Cap do that. That was a good last minute swap. Ooh, opponent most to five. Yeesh. I assume this is getting shocked. Oh no, deduce, okay. Um, attack, and then we'll just play specialist face down. Crack your clue. Um, turn you face up, bounce, play analyst, trigger, send, Mm-hmm. Haunch is really a good draw here. So what I get to do is just equip this to specialist, which can't be blocked right now. And then next turn we get to on the job pre-crack the clue and then be able to attack with analyst. Though we may not even do that, we might want to set up for sack haunch make two more one ones for a an even more wide turn okay person of interest do you attack with cold case cracker now maybe no yeah now i'm wondering if we just do well very tempting they'll trade enforcer for cracker chump specialist maybe oh it's not even a chump they would trade with specialists those are just bad bad attacks all around um I might move this here then. Yeah. Oh, they have something. Okay. Blocks, you got it. Wanting to make sure you have red, red up because it's dog walker. Okay. Uh, sack. 
pay. Oh, you're new. I still think this is worth firing off. I'm going to do a little bit of the like Yeah. Okay. I don't have on the job. I mean clearly I do, but A little bit of the tech I learned earlier this week. I was playing against someone and they like limped their attackers to the red zone. And I was like, well, they don't have on the job because when you have on the job, you attack all. And then they did. Oh, okay. Surveil top. It wasn't Dog Walker? Or it was! What? You didn't flip it up. That's crazy. Okay. No blocks. And now you're going to Wrath. No oh, face down. All right. All righty. I won't be, oh wait, one, two, three, yes I will. Okay, so play it face down, flip it up, tap. Pay the ward. Hopefully get in for six, we'll see. Tap you, yes. Pay. Take action. Discard. Lethals? No. Shock. Out cold. All right. That is cold. <laughs> no blocks. I do need to make notes. Oh. Oh, my. Okay. Defender at large, dog walker, 2x unauthorized, uh, yeah, play inspector first, face down, Out cold, deduce. Gosh, projector inspector is so sick. No block. Crime Stopper Sprite. Okay. And another face down. Crack a clue. Oh, 
Does that do it? Not quite, but... Hmm. I'm just thinking about, do I want to play with... I feel like I still want to be tapping down the offender. So I think what I'm going to do is attack with these two. Trade, trade, deal. That was a granite witness. Yeah, and then should be able to just do this tap offender and win. Okay. Okay, got there. Blue red tempo, they mold the five. They have, a, they have a good deck. Okay. Do I have anything I can bring in? Conundrum, Crocodelf. Flying doesn't seem great against them. I still think Call of Surprise Witness getting back one of these threes is good. I could see just wanting some beef. Like a criminologist's. Probably just going to keep it as is. All right. does not seem very keepable. Also not very keepable, but at least has three spells instead of one. Play Consultant. So they have an unauthorized exit in their hand. I'm gonna play a face down buddy. I think I also want to play a face down buddy and pass. The face down buddies we've seen, Dog Walker, Granite Witness, and Offender at Large. All of those I would trade for with the smuggler. If they stumble here, like miss a third land or miss a fourth land, Playing Red Herring Post, yeah, okay, oh. So now, 
I just want to play Private Eye, I think. And probably scry land to the toe. Oh, that's so tempting. But I think I'd much rather just play to the board. Play private eye and then we have out cold and on the job while they're like either going to just sack red herring to hit their land. Bouncing private eye. Oh, okay. Stealing the tempo back. Um, I think bubble smuggler is worthless enough and your morphs are all good enough that I'll take it there. Got a fender. And we could even just play exit specialist and call a surprise witness this turn. And I think I like that. So I'm just going to do that. Play Specialist, play Witness. Pretty sure they still have um, an unauthorized exit in their hand. just worth thinking about for private eye as a good bounce no blocks yeah person of interest i think i think we're just sending here yeah get a just massive on the job or if they choose not to block, we can have out cold. But yeah. Sort of damned if you do, damned if you don't. Wow, that's such a big hit. You're at five? Yeah. So if they pitch something and then have land here, yeah. So they have exit. I think I can win through that, though, if they let us go to attacks. Oh, okay. Nice. 2-0. Okay. All righty. Opponent goes first. We'll keep this hand. A little bit more defensive, but... Certainly does some things. Undercity sewers. Yep. Binning a swamp. Unscrupulous agent. It's one of the two spells on the job or reasonable doubt. I think it's reasonable doubt. I think we're playing to the board a lot this game. I think it's just witness. I feel like they have a counter spell. Maybe not. I don't know. Nothing. Three mana, nothing. Okay. 
four mana Mortipede. I didn't know that we played that card. I guess I'm just going to play Private Eye here. Clandestine Meddler. Mm -hmm. Nothing, nothing. Wow. I'll pass. Repeat Offender. Tap you. Take action. Do. Yeah, we're going to do on the job pre. Crack the clue. Private eye can't be blocked. Tackle. It was very surprising. So they have a wrath. I no. If they had a wrath, they would not. They would. Not multi-block. Maybe they would. So now they're going to Mortipede, gain some life. Yeah. Okay. Very interesting. Okay. Ooh. All right. We'll start with Inspector. Discard a land. You can't be blocked. Uh, no, I think I like saving Enforcer and then we'll haunch. Equip. Send. Chump. Uh-huh. I think we got there. Take action. Ship it. Yeah. Woo. Scary to like be 2-0, face a blue black deck and expect like I expect it to be strong, but that seemed like blue black mediums to me so far. Like best card by a lot was surveillance monitor. Also looked like they flooded a little bit. Okay. Can assume removal from them. I wonder if that means I want to play Faith Lights. Like we can assume interaction from Blue Black. And also they seemed pretty soft to flyers. I wonder if Faith Light over something like make your move not seeming great against Blue Black here. I could see maybe cutting make your move playing Faith Light instead. Try that. Any land gives us witness. What do I have? Ten white sources? Nine white sources? Any land gives us witness. I have smuggler, analyst, specialist, reasonable doubt. Uh, 
and then certainly any planes. I think this is a keep. It's extremely close, but I think it's a keep. Also, against Unscrupulous Agent, like, mulliganing is pretty bad. So there's the any land. Repeat Offender. And always lucky. Never not lucky. Extract, sure. Wow. A true dream. True dream. Oh, yeah, I'll take that action. Probably get rid of Fave Flight at this point. Yeah. No blocks. What do you got? Okay. Inspector first, and then probably witness face down. Like, inspector, attack, witness face down. Pitch, island. Faith Flight would have been good there against that murder. Out cold. I just like... Um, so my options here are Enforcer, Flip Up, Witness, Tap, Attack. Which I think I like setting up Watchdog. Conversely, I could just out cold something. I think I like flip up, tap, attack, play enforcer. I guess could have done this in the reverse order to play around reasonable doubt, but I'm not that concerned. They're going to pump repeat offender and kill enforcer. Oh, just bounce, yeah, sure. And they bend a land, okay. Uh, or some evidence being collected here. The Eliminator. Killing Witness, sure. I'm all, all fine with this. Yeah, I think Haunch, Equip Inspector, Attack, and then Play Enforcer. Really? All right. Macabre reconstruction, that makes sense. Let's repeat offender. Surveil slightly awkward. Let's see what we find. We find a private eye. So yeah, we'll we'll draw that for sure. Pump pump. Face down. And long goodbye. Wow. All right. Ouch, ouch. Equip. Attack. Play watchdog.
No blocks. We're gonna eliminate the enforcer here, I assume. I'm really left with only one thing to do, which is equip out cold these two. Send for five. Forensic researcher. Okay, well, you're going to have to chump. And then I think we're actually just going to bubble smuggler face down so that I can sack haunch or bubble smuggler as is sack haunch, get two one ones, smash all with watchdog pump and on the job. And they can't flip up their morphs. Yeah, this is brutal. Gotcha. Wow. Roy and a smuggler of your own. I think it's the end. I'm not like they could have a wrath off the top, I guess. Yeah. Ooh, three O. Oh, well, guaranteed. Guaranteed a second draft. Very stressful game one, match one. Very stressful entire match one, honestly, with the no witnesses. But now. Just hoping to get the uh, the 4-0. Deck is humming along, truly. All right, match four, play first. Keep. Market watch on two. Leering onlooker, blanking my attacks, how dare. Projector inspector is a nice draw. We'll start with that. Take action. I think bin bubble smuggler. No attacks. Black red could be scary. Oh, Grixis, definitely scary. Face down, all right. No attacks from the opponent. Yeah, I think we just hedge maze and witness face down. Definitely want that. Do we send? What am I doing next turn? No, I don't think so. Next turn. Detective's Satchel. All right. Sorry, I'm really having a hard time figuring out what to do here. Feels like my window to push damage is closing. I think it's just novice inspector. And I guess if we hit a land, take action. Oh. 
Binding on Onlooker is excellent here. So we'll just do that, I think. And that means we're getting rid of Haunch, yeah. Okay. Binding Onlooker. I also think we're sending everybody. And we'll trade with this disguise. Yeah, that's fine. Less blockers, less options. Okay, offender at large. Detective Satchel. Shock Inspector isn't great, um, but it's fine. I'm going to attack all here. Play Witness face down. Probably flip it up to tap something. Seems good for me. Seems good for me. I may not flip it up now. I don't know. Play a four drop. Tap out. Shock. Okay. You gonna pay two? I'll flip this up. You're late. Let's do this. Nice. What a draw. Wow. Send. Two shocks. Attacking with a thopter. You don't say. Because you have like, is there a sack a thing, kill a thing? Yeah. In, in fact, there is. Okay. Oh, wow. And that triggers satchel. Ooh. Okay. So I, on the job here, I lose phantom. Just don't push enough damage. So. I think we just pass. And just think about make your move on Satchel if they have a way to make a clue, I guess. We have time. Not so much time anymore. I guess I offered a trade phantom for this face down buddy. And if it's like a fender, we can just kill it. Alley assailant. Rip. All right. Well, you got me. That is pretty brutal. And then crack a clue. That's not bad. Bother is not bad here. I thought I had a land drop to give. That's why I cracked the clue. 
Now I'm going to regret it because they're going to make another Thopter. Yeesh. That is outrageous. I mean, that's in the realm of top decks. It's not the worst. Bin bin. Pump. Pump. Oh. Pump. Hit for four. I don't understand why. Like, there's this weird bug, I think, with Outrageous Robbery, where, like, I just know that they hit five lands, right? And those are the only two spells. Because it, like, just played the land from exile. So weird. Oh, Watchdog's cute. Probably have an out have out cold here. Or another shock. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. Furious Rage. All right, you got me. I don't think I'm supposed to block there. Just to like try and leverage things. Um, okay. Fae Flight, it's not like crazy favorable against two shocks. Desist. Still not great in this spot. I didn't really see any fixing from them, right? They're just red black splashing satchel though. Two shocks. Not great against double projector inspector. I kind of like Fae Flight over Call. And I think over Reasonable Doubt. We'll see. Let's try that. All right, play first. Great hand will keep. I think no out cold. I think I'd rather have threats or land. Right, probably just threats, because what I'd like to do is like consultant, inspector, a threat, and then pop off with fuss. There's your, there's your fixing. This is just shock. No question. Oh. Yeah, we'll just get our loot on. I know. You're licking your lips here. And bin an island. Do your worst. Now I guess we're just going to be casting Bother, play Phantom. No nothing on three? Grixis mana, no nothing. What the heck? Satchel, Harried Dronesmith. Okay. That can get bound. And... Bother take me home, I guess. Shock. Okay. And satchel and nothing. 
Oh, it's so tempting, but I think we just attack and play bother. Uh, yeah, we, we want, we want both of these top, top soul innervation. Wow. Oh, <laughs> wow. Is that good for me? Um, hmm. yeah, let's get shocked. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay, making it interesting. Soul Enervation. Harried Drone Smith. I mean, I like. Actually, I wonder if Reasonable Doubt because of Outrageous Robbery is, is worth playing here. Make your move isn't that good against them. Like, it can blow up Satchel, but that's not good. We saw a Fender at large. Yeah, I think I'm going to cut Make Your Move and keep in Reasonable Doubt. And just, you're just going to mulligan into Oblivion. That's what we're going to do. Sure. It's not great, but I know they're not fast. Okay. I don't think they have shock yet. The question is, yeah, we're just gonna play this. Get our loots on. Excuse me. All right. Now it gets interesting. I think it's got to be Private Eye and, and hope one, we can fade one removal spell here. Pitch this. Your, yeah, attack. Fade a soul innervation, please. It's just too hard to like resist getting the pump plus the loot plus the unblockable. And if we get to untap, then I think we're in a really good spot. No blocks. Never blocks. Cranko. Okay. We are going to play Phantom. What is single black? Oh, you get to just... Sack an artifact, put a counter, and then make a thopter. It's very interesting. Okay, take action. Bin. I don't know what. I'm never tapping out of Fae Flight. Probably just a land. You. Whenever you sack an artifact. Yeah, well, this is uh it's very cute. Very cute. I'm kinda surprised they didn't do it there. They could have sacked the clue, made Cranko a 4-4, and made a Thopter, I think. They should, definitely should have done that. The 
this is this pay red. Yep. Okay. Resolves. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like Enforcer here. Now I want to get rid of Inspector, I think. Mm, no, I want to get rid of Witness. You're unblockable. Yep. Is this toxin analysis? Pretty annoying. Okay. But I guess better that than on Enforcer. Come on, cast under city eliminator. Yeah. Do it. Do it now. Okay. Uh Inspector. Pay flight. <laughs> Take action. Get rid of you. You're unblockable. Take action. Get rid of you, I think. Yeah. Send. Cautiously optimistic. Yep, yeah, crack a clue. But like, you're taking seven and you have so many problems to deal with next turn? Are you, bl oh, this is, no. Hmm. Uh, block enforcer and shock it. see yeah, yeah. Hmm. you're at one I guess I could lose this turn All right, private eye down. You still have to be able to sack something here. 
I also might just now might maybe we just bother. Or I can guardian. I can guardian inspector also. Pumps the enforcer to three. And then I have guardian and play to bother next turn. Seems like bother is the play. Like it just forces them to have to gain life. And then it's four lethal attackers if you don't gain life. Reasonable doubt. Haunt, yeah, haunt seems fine. No attacks. Yep. Okay, kill one Thopter. This went ever a sacker and alright, put it to a graveyard. Yeah, there you go. Pay red if you want. Do not want. Shock shock. Buys you another turn. Concealed weapon. To sacrifice that, make a one. Okay, so, but hopefully, this will all, well, not all, but get to inspector. So if they have, <laughs> that's so many triggers, too many triggers there, folks. Uh, pump you, right? Because this is already going to be a 2-2. Two -two. Okay, shock. Well, now we pitch this because this is going to be a uh, sure, take action, pitch that, play smuggler, pump you, and now you have to chump chump with two thopters. We have five blockers plus two lethal attackers still. So you sack weapon, make a 1-1, one, one, chump chump. Oh, what? Oh, reach! I forgot about reach.
Definitely forgot about Reach. Okay. I might be dead here. I forgot about Reach. There's nothing I could really do about that, though, right? Oh, no! So close! I cut a uh, Call a Surprise Witness, right? So we can't get... Um... Oh. Okay. Is that... That's not anything. No, Satchel's about to own my soul here. I don't think I can win now. <laughs> yeah. Sack, make two one ones. Uh, sure. Oh, so close. I, I I don't think there's anything I could have done about reach on the orangutan, but I definitely forgot that that was a thing. Sack, make two thopters. Yeah, we're we're toast here. The goose is uh, is pretty cooked here. I would say. Oh, I was so close too. I thought I thought for sure we were gonna win that one. The Faith Light on the Private Eye. Yeah, now I think we're just done. No blocks. Mm, I guess should have done that on my turn because I'm missing out on these loots. Oh. No, I don't want to do that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. But then they're going to have eight, nine. Right? Yeah. All right. We're going to call it. I don't. I just, I just need to look at my deck just to make sure that there's like nothing I could actually draw here. Faith Light. Does Faith Light randomly on something do it? Does Out Cold do it? No. Exit specialist, no. Just too many thopters. I mean, I guess it forces them to, like... I'm not out of it. I can't concede yet, I don't think. I think I am out of it, but attack, 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 sure. Block, block, chump. Here, do I have another witness? No. I bend it? Yeah. Oh, and we're getting, witness is getting shocked here. Oh, no. It's a pretty epic run. I really thought we had that that win. I'm sure if I missed it, y'all will tell me. 
don't think I did though. Definitely forget that orangutan has reach. All right, uh, block, block, block. Oh, I am just dead, right? Especially if this is, uh, I guess I just have to hope it's not a fender at large, but that is the only. Only one that we've seen. Oh, and you just pump all your goblins anyway. Yeah, all right. We win. Nicely done, opponent. Your deck is sick. Double satchel, Cranko. It's tough. I'll take the 3-1. Just need a good draft for the second one. And, uh, and we'll get some cash. Hopefully we can make it happen. See you then.